some new Stormtrooper classes, Captain Phasma, and Kylo Ren's new looks for Star Wars The Last Jedi have just been revealed by MakingStarWars.net. While they aren't screenshots from the movie itself, they are artist depictions from someone who has seen the trailers that were shown at the special events where Disney showed short clips. So let's just start off with the new Stormtrooper Executor class. Now, I'm not sure what is meant by Executor. Executor could mean like, as in like almost like a guillotine type execution where someone's doing that type of thing, or it could just be a new weapon that can penetrate lightsabers just like the staff that we see um, Traitor use against Finn. I think the overall design is very cool. I think the weapon looks absolutely amazing, and I just think that the black markings on his face and shoulders are also very, very cool. In this next image, we see the same Executioner Stormtrooper, another Stormtrooper with the same markings, which I'm assuming is just another Executioner, and then we see Captain Phasma. You can see Phasma doesn't look too, too different, but you can see she's got a staff, which is apparently a new part where she's got some sort of force pike or something on those lines, which is pretty cool. And now, of course, the one everyone, I'm sure, wanted to see when they clicked on this video, Kylo Ren. He pretty much looks as you'd imagine, um, with the same lightsaber, pretty much the same robe, a new cape looking thing, which is pretty cool, um, and the scar on his face. We know that um, this is what he's gonna look like, but um, we also know that he is going to have a new mask, Apparently, it's um, going to look very similar to the old mask, and most people won't notice. But for us diehards, we'll see that it doesn't have the same dents and damages as it did in Force Awakens. So it is technically the same type of mask, but it isn't. I guess I guess you could say it isn't really a plot hole because the old one did get destroyed. It's just that this one won't have the same damage, just to signify that it's a different helmet. This whole story came from a person called Lumberjack Nick. He is quite a reliable source um, on the most part, and I think that this is very likely to happen. I think it would confuse people too much if Kylo Ren had too different of a mask, so that seems plausible. I think him having a scar is very plausible because everyone saw The Force Awakens and so he got slashed in the face, so obviously he's going to have a scar. Um, Phasma's staff, why not, I guess. Um, the Executioner, I, th I think that looks pretty good. I feel like... Um, this could actually be what's going to happen in the movie. I think we're going to actually see the things, and it just makes me that much more excited for Last Jedi. Last Jedi looks absolutely incredible. I've been live streaming a little bit lately, and last night I had an absolutely awesome stream. Shout out to Cosmic Pizza, who was in the stream pretty much the entire time, and some other guys. Um, but Cosmic Pizza, you were the one that was in the stream the entire time. I'm planning on doing some more streams since they are really, really fun. Of course, for a thousand subscribers, there's going to be a huge stream. Thinking about maybe doing a giveaway during that stream as well, so you guys need to stay tuned. Leave in the comments what you think I should do in these live streams, and also leave in the comments what you think of these designs, and if you think it is plausible that we're going to get these designs and that they're reliable. I hope you all thoroughly enjoyed this video. Make sure to leave the video a like. It shows me that you are enjoying the videos. The videos that get more likes, I will definitely make a follow-up to. Um, hit subscribe if you haven't already. It means that you'll get notified when I stream. You'll get notified when I make a new video. And also, just make sure to have a great day.